Hi guys, welcome to Mommy's episode, and today I am opening two more Ever After High dolls, which I still have a lot to go through, so I'm going to start doing two each video. Um, today I have Faybelle Thorne, and she is a royal. Okay. And then, I'm so excited about Bunny Blanc, that I've got Bunny Blanc to open. Had for just, I've had her for about a little bit little while so I can't wait to get her open. Here is the back of Bunny's box. She is also a royal. And of course here's the back of Faybelle Thorns. Daughter of the Dark Fairy. And of course most of you all know that she is the daughter of the White Rabbit. So I am going to get these open so we can get a close up look of them both and I will see you in just a second. Okay guys, so I finally got them out of the package and they are just absolutely gorgeous as per the norm for an Ever After High doll. Okay, so first we are going to look at Faye Bell Thorne and she has just, oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so she's got the silver base with the silver brush. I've got like a million of these now. And of course her, st her storybook. So I'm going to take her off this stand to show you a little bit what she looks like. So her hair, of course, is just in a natural little butt, um, ponytail, and they didn't do much with it, so it's good and soft, which is good because I can't stand. I'll show you in a minute. So she has got a blue streak in her hair right down there, which is really, really cute. And she's got these earrings on that, to me, they look like keys. I could be wrong. Or a stick. I don't know. Let's try to get a close up of her earrings. Hope you guys can see that. And then her tiara, of course, is some twigs, which is probably what her earrings are. So let's just put her tiara up there. Okay, now we're gonna move on to her wings that are just kind of snapped into her the back of her necklace. So here, let me show you her necklace first. So there's her necklace. And then on the, it comes around to the back, of course, and it kind of goes down to where her wings are attached. And her wings feel like kind of like that jelly type of material, so it's really soft and pliable. Okay, let's put her hair back down. And then, of course, she comes with her purse, which I lost the uh, rubber band to, so it's kind of loose. Whoops. And then her cuff that goes down into a ring. Hopefully that's focusing, because I can't see. And then her shirt is really pretty. It's the blue and green, kind of like confetti looking stuff all over it, and it's real sparkly. And it's like she's got these blue tights on, and these are like really soft, so it's like spandex, legging type material. And then her boots are really, really cute, and they're split at the they're slit in the back with, for easy takeoff. But here are her teal boots. And then the heel. Heel looks really cool. It's like a platform wedge kind of thing. I just knocked over poor bunny. So there is the, the specs of Fayville Thorn. Okay, so I'm going to put her back on her stand and set her aside. Oh, I didn't show you. Duh. Look at her face. The face, the facial features of these Ever After High dolls are like my favorite. So here is her, look at the detail on her eye. Is that not cute? I love these dolls' faces. They're just so pretty. She's got violet purple eyes. Okay, come here, bunny. Okay, so first I'm gonna start off with the hair. Her hair is styled so much that it is super stiff, which is fine, but it looks almost like her hair is all stringy and nasty, which I don't like. So, of course, she comes with the gold base with the gold brush and also her storybook. So, I'm take her off her stand and get, get a close up. So here, let's get a close up of her hair is what I was talking about. So you can literally push up on it and it's just like, ew. But 
it's fine. It's whatever. Even her bangs are like that, so. I don't know, maybe I'll just keep playing with her hair to get that stiffness out. But anyways, so here's her headband. She's got her two ears. One's kind of, you know, folded down. The other one's up. And she's got her top hat with the clock on it. So she won't be late to a very important date. Okay, and here is her, I guess it's a purse, but it's like a little time piece. Is also gold. Alright, there's not a lot of accessories on her, so she's pretty simple and cute. Her her face is really cute too. She's got the pink lips and her body's a little tin, tinged pink, I guess you could say. Okay, and she comes with these little cuffs. That's pretty much all the jewelry that she comes with. Okay, and she's got like a little tie, pink tie, on the shirt underneath her outfit. And it's, of course, fur, which I think is an ode to rabbit fur. And then her skirt is short, shorter in the front and longer in the back. And it's got the plaid and all the clocks all over it, which I think is adorable. And then her boots slash platforms and it's got like a little bunny bunny poof in the back a little bunny tail see that right there I like her and of course as always um, ever after high dolls are articulated in the waist in the hips in the knees in the wrists elbow shoulder and the neck so they're, they're really cute posed and you can pose them however you want. Well guys, I guess that is it for Faybell Thorn and Bunny Blanc. Guys, I want to thank you so much for watching. Um, if you haven't yet, go check us out on all of our social medias. We are on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Periscope. And if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button, comment, and thumbs up. We'll see y'all in our next video.